And as TV3 News, we needed to do some fact checking. And our reporter, Ibrahim Abubakar, was back at the site after the November 2020 fanfare when the president, Anado Dankwe Kufuado, cut sword for the project to resume. Started in 2001, the Buankra inland port was expected to link Tema and Takradi ports to the inner part of the country and other landlocked countries, such as Burkina Faso, Niger, and Mali. The inland port has the potential to boost economic activities, create employment, ease transport congestion, and reduce the high cost of transporting goods and services up north by road. But work on the project stalled for 19 years. President Akufado in November 2020 cut short for work to resume on the project, now Buankra Integrated Logistics Terminal. The project was expected to be completed in three years at a cost of $330 million. Work is now set to begin after the conclusion of all financial, contractual, legal, parliamentary, and regulatory matters and approvals. The project period is three years. Work was expected to commence later by March 2021, but a visit to the project site almost a year later shows no sign of work. The administration block constructed in 2001 is the only building sitting on the project site. Years of neglect has left the building in a deplorable state. Residents of Buankra are not satisfied with the turn of events. Up till now, we have not seen anything. Last December, uh, November, the president came here to tell us they are going to start it around March this year. But up to I think this October, September, we haven't heard anything. It's all this now, bad, bad thing that we are seeing here. So we are pleading now with the government to at least uh, come to our aid. Because without completing the job, they are giving us a lot of problems. There is no job in this community. Uh, so we are pleading an ado so that you come and complete the Elan port for us so that the youth can get a job to do. Last year, When the president cut sword last year, we were all happy, hoping there will be a boost in economic activities here. But nothing has happened so far. We plead with the president to ensure work starts in earnest. Ashanti Regional Chairman of Ghana Shippers Council Committee, Joseph Amwa, expects government to deliver as promised by making the project a reality. For us in the North Brown and in Ashanti region, uh, distance has been an issue for us, especially when we are clearing our goods. You have to go all the way to either Tema or to Takrade to get your goods cleared. Not to talk about the extra transportation to haul such materials from Takrade or Tema to the interior part of the country. So we are pleading to the government, especially now the Danko Kufuado, that this time around, the Bankra must see the light of day. The project is expected to create thousands of jobs for Ghanaians and also serve as a catalyst for the economic development of Bankra and Ashanti region at large. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, Bankra, Ashanti region.